Well, in this digital world, um, actually, there's a current revolution called the analog revolution. It It's using, in this case, old photographic processes to create modern art. I'm not trying to recreate or trying to make my work look old. I'm trying to create new work in an old way. It used to be, at, at the time when this process was invented, photography was the ultimate truth. If you took a photograph of something, it was the truth. Now, it's quite the opposite. It's as malleable as, as a painting. Um, you switch heads, switch faces, uh, remove things. People don't even actually, frankly, care about the digital images too much that they photograph. It's not uh, even about the image anymore. My complaint with digital in regards to fine art photography are people that take digital images because they're quick and easy and then try to make them look um, like a real piece of film or a Polaroid image or in our case a wet plate collodion image. They actually fake and Photoshop. If you're going to go to that extent why don't you just learn the real thing because it's I mean it does this process is a all-in-all all time-consuming majorly involved life kind of uh, experience. If they walked into my traveling darkroom even though it's driven by an Isuzu diesel engine, uh, and theirs were by horses, they would step into the darkroom and look around and go, oh, and feel completely at home with the cameras, the lenses, and the chemistry that I have. They would not feel, they wouldn't miss a beat. I look at their images, I see the mistakes they made, they're the same mistakes I made. The chemistry that I use is ex identical to the chemistry they used. Every half an hour I take one photograph. Fifteen images in one day would be an extremely tiresome, long, very involved, very, very involved day. I expect every single image that I take to be a finished final image. It isn't just, oh well, we'll see what happens. I've been doing historical photographic process for about 25 years now, working with these big cameras in 30 years, but it definitely is uh, a lot of alchemy. It is a lot of magic, complete absolute magic. You, you're looking at this turning light and silver into an image on a piece of glass, which is sand. I mean, it really is amazing how this all works. My name is Luther Gerlach, and I'm a fine art wet play Clodian photographer.